this video I will show you how to create your own intro outro banner using free website and free program like the one you just saw or there is an outro at the end of my video first thing we need to do is get you the music for your intro there is a link to the YouTube copyright free music library in my description there's a lot of confusion on YouTube about copyright this is because a lot of YouTubers use copyright things in their videos, but we don't know if they've been caught and keeping the video up or just haven't been caught yet. There's ways to get caught. One, the computer program analyzes the video. If this happens, you get it quite soon after the video is released. Two, someone reports you and makes a claim against you. Three, you apply for monetization and a real person watches all your videos. Any copyright material in your videos and you don't get monetized. You have to wait a month before you can reapply. There's a few myths, which are not true, are flying around. You can play less than nine seconds, as long as you acknowledge the artist, or you put no copyright infringement was intended. None of these are true. The person who created the music, the picture, or the video owns the copyright unless they state he is copyright free or royalty free. So I think it's best if we make sure we have copyright free music and do not take another YouTuber's word for some of being copyright free. Another YouTuber gave me some music which they told me was copyright free and when I went to check it wasn't. <laughs> which I was kind of good about because I really like that music. <laughs> There's a lot of different music to choose from, so to narrow down the search, I'm going to go across the top. I'm going to change it to alternative. I'm going to make the mood happy, and I'm a total thumbs girl, so that's narrowed my search down to five. So now I just click on play to see if there's any I like. Then I click on the download and it will be sent to this PC's download on my computer. Now for your intro or outro. This is a free website. There is a link in my description below. You can make your own intro, just click on new project. But there are plenty of free templates to get you started. You go down the screen on your left. See if there's one that you like. If not, click on more creations. I have already chosen one to work on. First thing I'm going to do is click on the mute button as I don't know if the music is copyright three on this template. That's the icon that looks like a speaker. It's red, it's on. Then I'm going to click on the I. That shows you what the finished product will look like and then click on play. I like this video so I'm going to keep it for the rest. Need to check the basic settings to make sure that the length is under 90 seconds or you start to lose your audience which it is and the rest of the settings look good so we'll keep that as that. The next thing we need to do is change the music so we need to go on the music icon, audio track, and then click on audio file, click on the select. If you did download the music from the YouTube library, it will be in this PC download. So you just go to that, click on whichever music you want, and then click on open. Now we have our music. We'll Take it off mute and press play. Now we want to change the words. So we're going to spin it across so we can see the words we're going to change. Then we're going to click on the 3D cube. And we're going to go down to the word we're going to change, where it says text and the word. Double click on it.
I'm going to change it to Aaron Storm. And once you've done that, you need to click slightly underneath the box to make sure the word is changed above. You're going to have to change the height of the word so it fits on the screen. So I'm going to change it to 18. And then do the same again, click on the actual screen so it changes. And do it again for the second one. Go down to where it says thanks and <laughs> and change it to own song. And um, remember to click underneath the box when you're done so it sticks. And I have to change the size again. Click underneath. There you go. Done. So we want to make sure it's correct, so we move the line across to the start. Make sure the eye symbol is red and press play. Now all that's left to do is render it, so you click on the arrow thing and click on render, this will take a couple of minutes. Then you click on download your video and the file will be sent to your PC to download. Now you have your new banner or intro or outro, you might want to change the format. This is Shotcut, a free editing and converting software. There is a link in my description below. The first thing you need to do is click on file. Click on open file. The file you have just downloaded will be in this PC to download. It will be labelled video. If you have downloaded more than one video, it will be labelled video one, video two and so on. Click on the video you want to convert, then click on open. Your file will be added to the screen. Under the screen there is a timeline. You click on the icon which has three lines, then you click on video track. Now you drag the video to the timeline. Now you can convert it. So you click on export on the top of the screen. Then you click on advanced. All the different types of formats you can convert are in that list. I want to convert to MP4, so I click on export file. Now I type in what you want to call it and then save. Once it is completed, on the right side of the screen will be lit up. You can right click on that, then click on show in folder and you will see your completed video in the folder and you're done.